It is seriously raining today. Um, it's like 319. It's really funny. Um, Tron was outside and he kept coming to the front door and hoping that the door would open, but it never opened. And then I, and then I finally opened it for him. Indeed. No, no, I just started it. Someone's running out in the rain. Hello, my love. Um, yeah, if you can see, I'll turn out this way. this thing right there um, finally and we can use it and he was bouncing all morning and he is passed out now so I'm pretty sure that little kiddo is going to be out for the day pretty much um, that thing's great he is two and a half months and he's already able to use it um, when we put little things in front of him and behind him but he doesn't really need them um, so that's pretty cool. He is so cute. <laughs> I have a video of it um, after I, you know, communicate with you guys and have a little talk, a little, little chit chat, you and me, you and y'all, you and yous. Um, yeah, uh, dinner last night over at my mom's house was pretty fun. And he loves, 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 you know, my stepdad. Um, I call him granddad. Um, what I call for indie poops, he is uh, granddad. He was smiling and smiling at us. Oh. And he's back asleep. I don't know what that was. <laughs> he just started crying for no reason. I guess he's back asleep. Um, there's an itch in my eye. So yeah, he was smiling and smiling at him for so long, and um, it was really sweet. I was over there for a while. Um, yeah. Our neighbors had like some huge party last night and I am not really one of the, like the type of person to like call on like the police on anybody but I feel like now that I have a kid and like a baby and I need to sleep it's like after 10 o'clock pretty much if you're like banging music and getting kind of loud and everything like it's kind of time for me to go to sleep and I don't exactly know what to do. Um, my mom said, you know, that's what you do. It's like call on the noise ordinance and stuff, and pretty much they'll tell them to, you know, quiet it down. But then Jake was kind of telling me I should just go over there and tell them that, hey, you know, we have a baby. But I'm kind of embarrassed to do that. So I don't really know exactly what to do with that. Um, kind of. I don't know, I don't want to be like the neighbor because we just bought this house and I don't want to go over it's probably too loud. I'm walking in. I guess he's back asleep. <laughs> um... I have to talk kind of into the mic because this thing, it it's kind of quiet if I don't really like super communicate into it. Um, her, her other neighbor was doing yard work in the rain for the past 45 minutes. She was just like working her butt off in the rain. I thought it was pretty funny thought it was pretty, pretty, pretty funny. Um, yeah, 
vlog. Jibba jabba jibba jib. Um, here I can. Indy, he's sleeping in his little bouncy thing. You know, the like the things that vibrate and stuff. He loves it. I'm probably waking, gonna wake him up again. Mm, oh man, today at Costco a few days ago, I got this stuff. It's um organic carrot juice. OMG, hello to organic freaking juice. So I think we're gonna use that bouncy thing a lot because not only does it get him in shape. It, um, I mean, gets him like strong. It really like makes his energy just right out of him. Um, so yes, last night my parents are like they work out like six days a week. Well, my stepdad and my mom, they work out like pretty much six days a week. And um, I used to work out all. Well, I'm starting to work out now because I'm not pregnant anymore. But um, you know, I played soccer. Uh, varsity softball JV basketball point guard for like all of high school and um, and I didn't try out senior year so I probably would have gone to varsity but I, I there was so many good players uh, of basketball at my school that pretty much I could only make the junior varsity um, they already had a really good point guard but the point guard left and if I were to try out senior year I probably would have made it but um so um, I, I, yesterday, Guillaume, my stepdad was like, if you can do 50 push-ups, I'll give you $50. And I was like, heck yes, but I can't do 50 push-ups. So, um, literally, like, I could only do 10. And I used to be able to do, like, a lot of them. And my arms today are so freaking sore like I'm actually right now leaning on them and they hurt really bad but I want um, I'm gonna do more today I I did my run today and I'm I'm gonna do more push-ups because that was really embarrassing my mom is like a lot older than me and she was busting them out and she's like how much do I get do I get and he's like 10 cents for each and she's like no and he's like fine 25 cents for each she's like no all right 50 cents and so I don't remember how much money she made but it was really funny to watch her like bust her butt to try to make some money and I think I made like three dollars <laughs> but mine was like seven well mine was like 75 cents for one if we were going to do it like that I never got any of the money but Whatever, I thought it was pretty funny. Oh, they're so sore. Oh, oh my gosh. Um. Yep, yep. Oh, in the mail today. Um. We got some really cute little overalls from my um. From my family on the Huller side, my mom's side. Um, it's really cute. Here, I'll go get it. Look at these. How cute are these? I love them. Thank you. Yeah, it was so cool. In the mail, um, I like because right now the window is out like the front where I am on the computer and I saw the woman walk up and drop it off I was like yes I got a package and like I watch youtubers all the time opening packages and I was like oh and then my family sent some packages that was really great um I loved it thank you um and I have more that I need to put on here from my dad's side his sisters and stuff have sent me a few things but two of them he can't wear yet and one of them he can and I was gonna take some pictures of those for them so yeah um Memorial Day weekend I'm not doing anything but I'll probably have some beer tonight 
Um, our neighbors on the other side, not the party neighbors, they're really nice. We're going to start doing yoga together. She actually has a um, three and a half year old and a two and a half year old. Um, and they're really sweet, like super sweet and fun. And she like gets tattoos and that's pretty cool. I was um, apprenticing for a year and I've done about 50 on skin. Um, I've done myself and I have two machines, but I need some tubes and I need some needles. So I told her that it's been about two years since I was apprenticing, so I need to, you know, work up to it again. I said, oh, I'll do some more on me and some on Jake, and and then um, I'll show you those before you just let me start on you again. Um, and she thought that was pretty cool. She was getting a consultation. Um, and I guess one video, I can show all my tattoos. Um, I have a pretty good amount of them. Well, not as many as some people, but um, I have my chest and I really want my shoulders really bad, both shoulders, and I have on my arm and my calves and my sides and, you know, I could use some more. Um, yeah, tattooing is pretty fun. It's actually not as intense. I mean, if you, you need to draw and stuff, obviously, but um, pretty much they tell you what they want and then you draw out the outlines you have them bring it in or you design it and but usually they bring in what they want and then you just do the outline and then um, you put it on their skin and you draw it out on them and you start from the bottom to the top and if you know how to shade and I mean it's it's so much easier I think than like it seems like to people it's like oh you're a tattoo or no it's like I don't know it's it's not that big of a deal really I mean the big deal to me is piercings like hello you're stabbing someone through the skin like ow I can't do it Jake can do it he's he's down with the stabbing of skin through skin uh, not me um, and plus, I mean, it's like you're drawing on someone's skin, so you can't even, doesn't even really tell that you're, like, hurting them until they're like, ouch, and stuff. Um, but yeah, so it's pretty fun. So I'm going to show you guys the video of Indy Boingy bouncing around. So I hope you guys enjoy that. I know I did. <laughs> I thought it was funny like supers, supers, a super dupas. All right, enjoy. <laughs> it's so little. Good job. <laughs> <laughs> Drawn. <laughs> Hi, kitty. <laughs> He's getting a kick out of I this. know. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, see, now his toes, so he can actually bounce. Ooh, you're moving. Did oh you? My God, how did I do that? <laughs> <laughs> I turned around. How would they? How would you do it? I would make the every part that there's a strap. I would make like a solid piece of metal, and then I'd make those pieces of metal adjustable for height. 